Welcome to event 5 of the Glass Ball Tournament. We go to heat 1 of Funnel Quick Spin. Rocky Rockers Meteor take an early lead out of the gate. The Coral Creatures with their captain follow suit. Now the Ghost Hunters have the lead, but Rocky Rockers have only fallen back to second. It's still anyone's game, and Ghost Hunters will come through with a good time, I might add. And, and the Peacemakers will get their final advancement spot over the Rocky Rockers, who choked by quite a lot, actually. Uh, as you can see in this replay, the Rocky Rockers starting off in a slightly disadvantageous position in the front. But this, but this, these last two funnels were crucial to why they, they couldn't make it. But congratulations to Peacemakers. First overall top half event finish. Hey, nice job. Maybe that can turn into a medal. Yeah, catch up mechanics, Miracle Makers, and Peacemakers were all very close together. Rocky Rock is almost losing to the Mid Majesties, but as you can see, the Mid Majesties just didn't fare well. Passed by the Poison Plants, passed by the Coral Creatures, and they finally finish. Looking at the finishing order here. Yeah, Ghost Hunters do win. They catch up Mechanics in second. Miracle Makers third and Peacemakers fourth, but Mid Majesties definitely had a chance to advance. They just couldn't take it. Now we have Heat 2. Some very powerful teams, but most of them are sending in the reserve. Two former champions, and one of them takes the lead out of the game. Already, the Darkness Ringers with bad. And, oh, the Roshianic, look at that. They're one-shotting every funnel. Oh, my God. The Darkness Ringers still take second, and the Ice Flasters take third. Who's going to advancement spot? I do believe that is... Oh, I actually can't tell what. Oh, I can see that Blaze is stuck. It is Hailstorm and the Ice Blasters. Hailstorm and the Ice Blasters will take the last spot of advancement. As you can see right here, these three marbles are fighting, and Blaze just somehow got stuck in all of this madness. And you can see Blaze stuck on that specific part of the funnel. And the Suns will get last in this event, which will hurt them even more in the standings. They aren't even doing well in the first place. Now we have the finals. Who will win? It is hard to tell who is the lead, but right now like, it is bad. Bad. For the Darkness Ringers, can they get their first gold of the season? Oh, the Ghost Hunters. Now Cantalucas has joined and Cantalucas have to leave. Peacemakers. Could not make it. Kento Crusaders and Darkness Ringers take the top two spots. Who will take third? Is the Ghost Hunters. Peacemakers. Sixth. Ice Flashers fifth. Roshianic will take a happy fourth. Keeping their top half streak alive. Despite having no medals. Quite interesting for a team. for To be all top halves with no, goal, no goals. And the Miracle Makers are stuck on the course. As we take a quick peek at the event standings, which, yeah, the Suns last and Cancel Crusaders are golden. Now, the overall standings. Darkness Ringers keep their lead. Three silvers and a bronze. 84 points. They now have a three medal streak. Can they continue it and possibly get another six medal streak like last season? Ice Blasters. They have 22 silvers and they send 72 points. Only 12 and the Darkness Ringers. Ghost Hunters jump up to fourth place, which is pretty good. Cantaloupe Corsairs are now in fourth. Sev up seven spots from their previous placement, which was eleventh. The bombs keep fall, keep their fall, keep their keep their disadvantage state, and they are not doing well. The Atlantic Assassins fall down one spot. The Rocky Rockers are still falling. But the Mim Majesties at the bottom, not good. Nine points in five events. That is not something you want to do. Peacemakers and Coral Creatures, also below 20. See you next event for block pushing. It sure is going to be an exciting event. Am I right?